Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. Belgium has declared an investment of 200 million euros earmarked for the acquisition of artillery munitions destined for Ukraine. This announcement came from Belgian Prime Minister Alexander de Croo during a press briefing, as part of a wider effort led by the Czech Republic to aid Ukraine in its resistance against Russian forces. The allocated budget of 200 million euros will facilitate the purchase of 50,155 mm shells sourced from outside the European Union, serving to assist Ukraine. This material backing is paramount for Kyiv, grappling with a shortage of weaponry amidst the Russian military advancement. Belgium's action is not occurring in isolation. It aligns with other nations such as the United Kingdom, the Netherlands, Denmark, Canada, and Sweden in extending financial support. The delivery of the munitions is slated for late March, signifying a significant stride in international backing for Ukraine. Nevertheless, the quantity of artillery munitions to be dispatched to the Ukrainian armed forces remains uncertain. The Czech initiative embodies a unified European effort to furnish military aid in the form of artillery munitions to Ukraine. This strategy emerged in response to Ukraine's urgent plea for additional military assistance amidst the Russian incursion. By spearheading this endeavor, the Czech Republic has established a mechanism wherein participating nations can contribute financially to procure essential artillery munitions for Ukraine. The primary objective of this initiative is to bolster Ukraine's defensive capabilities by supplying it with artillery shells crucial for repulsing Russian forces and safeguarding Ukrainian territories. The selection of 155mm shells is deliberate due to their compatibility with the weapon systems utilized by Ukrainian forces, ensuring direct and effective support in the conflict. The coordination of this plan through a European framework not only enables a substantial pooling of financial resources but also guarantees a consistent and swift distribution of munitions to Ukraine. Beyond the Czech Republic, numerous countries have answered this call, underscoring European and international solidarity with Ukraine. This initiative emphasizes the significance and reliance on foreign aid for the Ukrainian armed forces. This announcement follows Prime Minister de Cruz's visit to Kyiv, coinciding with the second anniversary of the Russian invasion of Ukraine. During this visit, Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky emphasized the urgency for Western nations to promptly supply munitions to fortify Ukrainian defenses against Russian assaults in the eastern region of the country. That's all for now. See you later.